Hey, what's up YouTube and GPK fam? It's your boy, Retro Hero, back doing another Garbage Pail Kids show and tell. This one's number 29. In today's episode, we are talking show and tell what's come in the mail over the last couple of weeks. Lots of cool things to talk about. Of course, I'm still working towards that goal of completing some of my foreign Garbage Pail Kid sets. So you see some German Garbage Pail Kid cards back there. We'll talk about those, how much they were each. Hopefully I can help everyone out there. You guessed it, GPK in a budget. I got another sealed box of some nice foreign garbage pail kid, Bukimi Kuhn back there. Some Sapphire came in the mail, some individual cards that I'm buying, just of my favorite characters. A really sweet sketch card back there, so we're gonna talk about that. And of course, we're gonna tear open that Garbage Pail Kids Beyond the Streets top network app exclusive box. Maybe we'll discuss some rumors out there on whether or not they have uncommon hits. We'll see what that looks like and we'll deep dive into those. We're of course doing today's video giveaway, that chunk fully posable action figure. That thing is sweet. We've got a new giveaway and let's not forget about that 500 subscriber giveaway. Once this channel reaches 500 subscribers, one of my lucky viewers is gonna walk away with that PSA graded seven original series two wax pack. Why don't you sit back, relax, and let's have some fun. Welcome back. If you remember in Garbage Pail Kids Show and Tell episode 28, we spoke about our giveaway this video and here it is from the iconic movie, The Goonies, Chunk. He is a three and three quarter inch fully posable action figure. He's adorable. It's sealed in wonderful condition. So we are giving Chunk away today. How did you get involved in last video's giveaway? It is really simple. I just asked in the notes if you would hashtag RetroHero1006. So if you put that in the comments, I'm gonna put your name in my handy dandy trash bin here. So this week we're putting in Michael Monkey Punch. Great name, bro, you're in there. Lori, you're always leaving comments. You're going in Aiken Cade. Bryman, you're in the drawing. I've got Tim, you're going in. Spoons, excuse me, you're going in. Uh, Nick, you're going in. Darren Anderson, what's up, buddy? Don't think I don't know that you sold that atom bomb on eBay, brother. I'm kidding, you contacted me. You're going in there. Uh, I've got Jake, you're going in there. Um, who else do we have? We got Ryan Edwards, you're in the drawing. Kevin, you're in there. Cool Doctor, uh, Robert Smith, what's up buddy? You're going in there, S. Sloan, Drew, L. J. G. Lewis, Adam Ford. We're gonna talk about Adam today. Congratulations, you're in there and not the droids, you're going in there. So here are all the names. Let's go ahead and shake this up and we are gonna draw a winner today. So here we go for the Goonies action figure. This week's winner is all right, uh, not the droids. So congratulations, not the droids. You are this week's winner for the Goonies action figure. I'm gonna pin your name in the comments. You just need to reach out to me. I'll get your address. Make sure you respond to me underneath your YouTube name so I can verify it's you, and I will send Chunk out to you in the mail. So again, congratulations, not the droids. You are this week's giveaway winner. So what am I doing for this next giveaway in Garbage Pail Kids Show and Tell episode 30? Well, first off, I'm going to give you some time in today's video what you need to hashtag and put in the comments. And if you do that, I'm going to put your name in the drawing. And here's our next video giveaway. 
He is adorable. This is a little teeny tiny atom bomb from Minikins, the original series. The sticker's in there. It's got a nice little holder. So he is going into the next giveaway. Got a couple of packages of wacky packages. I really love tearing these open. These are great. They come with some special parallel cards in here. So these are for the next giveaway. And the piece of resistance, here it is. This is a sealed pack of Chrome. Original Series 2, four cards. What could be in this sealed pack? There could be a plate. There could be one of those elusive supers that are still floating out around out there. Could be a bunch of stuff in here. Whatever's in here, if you're the winner, you're going to find out. So this is going to be our next week's giveaway. And again, what will you need to do? You're going to need to watch today's video and find out what you need to hashtag for that. Let's go ahead and jump into today's video. Okay, now for the show and tell portion of today's video. Um, first thing I want to talk about is something really unexpected. Uh, just in a comment on one of my videos a while back, um, Adam Ford left me a comment and said, Hey, I really, uh, what about that magnet card? I thought he was talking about the magnets and gummy candy. He was talking about uh, GPK Nick's uh, magnet, but we connected and he's like, yeah, I do some artwork and, uh, I'll send you a sketch card. I'm like, yeah, that's great. He knew what my favorite character was. Um, up Chuck, even Steven. Um, I've done a little bit of research on Adam. Uh, first off, let's just take a look at this card. So Adam sent this to me just out of the kindness of his heart. This is amazing. I mean, this is amazing art. Let's take a look at the colors. Um, really, really well done. I really like how you combined everything in here in the shading. This is truly a, a top quality sketch card done by Adam Ford. You can see AF uh, 2020. Um, Adam, you can follow him on Instagram at adamford948, or you can email Adam and ask him to do a commission for you as well. It's Doom faceford at gmail.com. So doomfaceford at gmail.com. Adam sent in a letter with this, um, just telling me, hey, he really likes my channel. So thank you so much. And shout out to his daughter, Penelope. Um, absolutely adorable little girl name. Top five of all time, Penelope. Penelope, hi. Um, your dad's a great artist and Penelope also does some sketching herself. So first off, um, Adam, thanks for sending me a sketch card. I'm going to send you one of those uh, Retro Hero mystery boxes. Um, it is just for you and Penelope to go ahead and open up and enjoy lots of GPK and non-sport goodies in there for you. Um, but I wanted to talk real quickly about Adam Ford. So a couple years ago, you guys all remember Nick Castadilla, GPK Nick. You know, he was doing sketching for the forums, and a lot of people thought that he was going to get picked up by Tops, and, and eventually he did. Um, there are artists out there that are just really good at what they do, and Adam is one of those. So um, catch him. He's probably going to get snatched up by Tops here eventually, and uh, these, these types of sketch cards, um, these commission rates are going to go up exponentially. So catch him early. Obviously, he's got some really great skills and an absolutely adorable daughter named Penelope. So thank you both very much. Really cool sketch card. That is a very welcome piece to my collection. Um, a couple more things, of course, same line, up Chuck, Heaven, Steven. So um, I bought a couple of the Sapphire, just my favorite character. I, I don't think I'm gonna go for a full Sapphire set. Um, they seem a little spendy, but uh, up Chuck here, this one is, um, 76 of 99 again a little off center but still an absolute beautiful card man i thought i was buying even steven but <laughs> i picked up a second up chuck um still off centered i think a majority of these sapphire were off centered um i don't know i haven't opened up my box but this one is uh 13 of 99 so still a very welcome addition to my collection and shout out to jerry aldo from the garbage pail kid marketplace on facebook Jerry sent me the green one. Um, I'm still waiting for a gold one coming from eBay, but this green one is absolutely beautiful, emerald green. A little better ce uh, centering on the green one, and the green one is number 11 of 50. So very welcome additions to my Upchuck, Heaven Steven collection, as well as Adam and Penelope's sketch card there. So uh, 
thank you uh, very much, Adam Ford and Jerry Aldo, for uh, hooking me up with some really cool Upchuck and Heaven Steven type merchandise. So you guys are awesome. Um, GPK Till Death on Instagram. You guys have heard me talk about him before. Um, he is, as far as I'm concerned, the end-all, be-all of foreign garbage pail kid cards. Um, he has helped me, along with a, a few others, Santos Chapa, um, really complete some foreign sets. I am moving into the German Garbage Pail Kids Diet Total Kaputin Kids, and this is 1994 Tops. Um, they are sticker cards that typically go in the album, although I never peel them and put them in the album. Um, the numbers are on the back of the cards. Um, I bought a little over 100 and maybe 130 cards, uh, pretty close to almost a complete set. I will tell you that uh, these things go for a couple bucks a piece, anywhere from 250 to four or five bucks a piece. So it can get spendy. However, um, GPK Till Death really did hook me up with a great deal. They ended up being just over a dollar a card, and I could not beat that. So um, I have a couple duplicates of these. So uh, maybe I'll throw a couple out to my um, faithful subscribers out there, and you can uh, start your own foreign garbage pail kid collection. But let's just take a look. Number 126 here, Jolly Roger, and very, very nice. Um, they are beautiful cards and in really good condition. I won't go through all of them. You know, you got your Chris Hiss here, um, Spacey Stacy, but they seem to be centered well. Corners are really sharp. Um, I am very excited when I receive these, uh, what type of condition they were in. Um, so often, foreign garbage pail kid cards make some trips. Now, a couple of these, um, if you take a look right there, you can kind of see that uh, they have the, they, they've been crimped more than likely from the packaging. Uh, the packaging was in that foil packaging if you saw those in a couple of my earlier videos. So that'll happen, but uh, still wonderful additions to my collection. Everything you see back here, it is all die total Kaputin kids. So lots and lots of different um, cards. So uh, welcome, welcome deal to my foreign collection. And I am getting really close to a foreign set of German Garbage Pail Kid cards. Uh, Kerr, Kerr Kleinhardt, if you guys are on the forum, Kerr is uh, truly a legend as far as Garbage Pail Kid collecting goes. He has lots of stuff. He does sales from time to time. Um, he put up sealed boxes of Bikimi Kuhn. And I was pretty stoked, man. I was like, uh, I don't want to buy four or five of them, Kerr, but I, I really want one of these box. I, I just picked up a pack a few weeks ago, and I thought how neat it would be to have a sealed box of Bukimi Kun, which is the uh, 2014 Series 1. And he said, sure, and he threw me a price. And I, I got to tell you guys, um, being on the forum and picking up things like this, you're going to save a ton of money. I, I probably picked this up for 50% less if not more than what you can purchase these on eBay for. Um, I didn't think I'd ever have a, a sealed box of Bukini Kuhn, and now I do, and I'm stoked to have this. It's going in my sealed box collection. So thank you, Kerr. Really, really appreciate that. Um, it, you see a Tops On Demand box over here. This inside this box is some um, bootleg Garbage Pail Kid cards. It is adult content, and because we said hi to Adam and Penelope, and I know Penelope is going to be watching this video, I'm going to save this for a different video just to go over some of the more, we'll call them rated R type um, bootlegs of Garbage Pail Kid cards, and and talk about value because there is a lot of value to some of these sets. So, um, but we will talk about those at a later time. So pretty stoked to do that. All right, as promised, um, we're going to tear open this box uh, Beyond the Street series. Um, this was done by Tops. You could only buy this on the network app. And uh, I learned about this from Collector Itis, and he's got a great channel. Um, I really like him. He's been doing this for a while. Um, you know, he does pack rips and in a lot of different variety of Garbage Pail Kid um, type videos. So, but he had how you could pick one of these up. Um, it was the beginning of December 
And, um, you know, I watched this video and then went into the notes and was like, yeah, that's awesome. I really want one of those. So i um, really thankful to Collector Itis for, for hooking me up. We are going to tear this open. Now, um, the purpose of buying this, first off, it says um, there's 20 packs per box. There's actually 24. Um, and then they said that uh, there is a chase card and it is a 0, zero Atom Bomb and 0, zero Blasted Billy. And uh, supposedly they only made a hundred of these. However, um, there are people that have opened up a box and, and haven't received any. There's people that have opened up a box and received four of them. So I'm, I'm not sure how the correlation went there um, for, or how they were correlated, I mean. Um, but uh, we, we're gonna open this up. They, they are going for anywhere between, you know, $300 all the way down to $60 for that zero zero atom bomb and blasted billy card but uh it's done by a variety of different artists and so far there hasn't been a lot of of great things said about this the card stock and so on and so forth uh, sorry for the glare but we're going to take a look at this and and see what we get 2020 really was the year of special sets uh everything to do with the sapphire and of course um the beyond the street with all the on-demand sets so Topps really uh, put out a lot of sets this year, and, and I don't know, or last year, and I don't know if I'm going to do, uh, you know, a whole bunch of these these sets for 2021. Um, the wrappers, as you can see, are just the um, silver foil kind of stuffed in here, but uh, let's take a look at these cards. So we're going to open uh, up, you know, let's just do all of these and, and take a look. So we'll start with this one, and no reason to save the wrappers. Okay, so uh, the back of the cards, adorable. They tell you who the artists are for the cards, but let's flip that over. Uh, Shoot Newton, um, so cardstock. Um, it is a little thinner than the standard cardstock. Uh, not much thinner than what Topps normally does, but a little bit. Um, not die cut, so uh, they are sticker cards. They do have the peel here, uh, but pretty cool artwork. We've got Shoot Newton. Um, art Gallery, Art Apart, Dribble and Derek, <laughs> Pina Claudia, Hippie Skippy, Dale Snail, and a really cool looking April Showers. Um, I like that card. So far, they, they look really nice. Um, I, I can't complain about these. Let's, let's break open another pack. I'm not going to read all the names to you. I'm sure you don't want to see all those, but we are going to take a look at the cards. So, okay. So here we go. Uh, looks like we have two of the exact same pack for the first pack that we opened up. Um, not so, not so uh, good. I, you know, I wouldn't be expecting that right away, but let's see what else we get. This one was backwards. So let's see what comes in this pack. All right. Different pack this time, <laughs> adorable. Haunted Hollis, uh, another Hollis build, that's your card, buddy. <laughs> Selfie fee, Geeky Gary, uh, nice play, Def Jeff there. Uh, Graffiti PD, I think that's kind of the Will Smith play on that, I like that card. Um, Plunging Penny and Hot Dot, another nice play on an original card. Um, so far, I'm pretty happy with the artwork on these. Here's the next pack. Let's hope it's not duplicates. No, it's not. So, Red Rod, Ashcan Andy, Rusty Bolts, Snot Ball Saul. There it is, semicolon. Semicolon. Traveling Travis, three card Monty, and Boney Tony. Really nice card artist on that one. Zach Rockstad. Zach Rothstad. Uh, very cool Boney Tony card. So what are we, we're four or three, four packs in, four packs in. Let's keep going. We're gonna open up all 24 packs and we're also gonna see if we get an entire set of these. So let's go through so you can kind of see these, put them in front of the camera. I really like some of the pay, uh, the plays on original Garbage Pail Kid cards. Um, that looks like it's like a claymation, really nice card. Split kit. Bruce Lee, <laughs> that's pretty cool. Jason Basin. 
I think these were all independent artists and they decided to put together a set and then Tox licensed this. I'm not sure of the nomenclature behind doing this type of a set, but I can tell you that thus far I'm pretty happy with the cards. Um, I'm not super happy with the duplicate packs that I'm getting, um, but they do look pretty good. Uh, so I'm, I'm assuming you're not going to get a full set in a box or, or maybe we will, but, uh, you might have to be trading with somebody else to get your full set. Um, here is the next pack. We'll see what we got here. Yep. There's another duplicate pack. So this is, we went through all these already. Uh, so, so far we've, we've done what, six, maybe more. And it looks like we have a whole bunch of duplicates. Let's try another one. I don't know if uh, they're just side-by-side -side duplicates, so I'm going to try pulling side-by-side -side here next and see what happens. So here it is, the, the 00A card. Um, this supposedly is the card that was limited to 100 for the run, and it is Adam Bomb 00A. And Beyond the Streets, KC Ortiz is the artist. So this supposedly is the difficult card to get. Um, yeah, I don't know. We'll set it aside and, and see how everything plays out. Billy Bling, Fruity Rudy, another Junkie Jeff, another Pin to Penny. Still a great card. Split Kit, Green Jean, and Bruce Lee, and Jason Basin. So... Uh, wow, that's a, a third pack, except for the C. Ortiz Adam Bomb card in there. Uh, this is the pack that was beside it in the box, so we'll see if we have the same thing. That'd be nice. Maybe we get two Adam Bombs. I saw uh, someone got four of them in a box. So it looks a little different. We got Freestyle Kyle, Spacey Stacy, Tim Can, uh, Little Leak Lynn, Beastie Boyd. Flat Tire, um, Shell Game, and Unzip Zack. So those are going to be your B names. Nice to get. Maybe we'll get a Blasted Billy uh, zero, 00 just to finish that off. But uh, let's take a look. So Billy Bling, Fruity Rudy, Junkie Jeff, Pin Penny, Split Kid, Green Jean, Bruce Lee, and Jason Basin. Uh, that's four packs of that we got. Um, the correlation might be like uh, the Garbage Gang trading card game thus far. Okay, uh, Freestyle Kyle, Spacey Stacy, Tim Can. Yeah, so again, another duplicate pack. Uh, not that I'm complaining. Uh, hey, it's still a nice set, but uh, I don't think unless I get pretty lucky here that I'm going to get a full set. Um, new cards, Mouth Phil, Halloween, <laughs> Brian, Brian, great card, wonderful art there. That's done by, is it, is it Posse or Poise? <laughs> uh, Deadly Dudley, uh, Fungus, Dynamike, like that, that's pretty cool. Uh, Dead Ted, that's nice artwork on Dead Ted, done by Sawblade. <laughs> and Leaky Lindsay. <laughs> Very cool. So some of these artists, um, obviously these are going to be a little bit more mainstream. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty pretty happy with the artwork. Again, not happy with the correlation of the packs, but fairly happy with the artwork. We did get the 00 Atom Bomb. We're still looking for Blasted Billy. So now we have Ken Kenny, Creepy Carol, Egotistical Emma, <laughs> cute card. TV Stevie, nice looking card. Audio Augie, New Wave Dave, Bob and Bob, and Mitch Match. So these are going to be the B names, or the A names for the B packs, which we've pulled, I think, twice. Uh, next pack, okay, so we're back to Mouth Phil, Hallow Dean, Fry and Brian, Deadly Deadly, Fungus, Dynamite, Dead Ted, and Leaky Lindsay again. So, okay. Next pack, oh, here we go again. Kennel Kenny, Creepy Carol, Egotistical Emma, TV Stevie, Adiagi, New Wave. Yeah, there is another pack that's the same. Okay. 
I might have to break open another box if I want a whole set. So these are going to be the B names this time from one of the first packs we opened. Sherman Tank, Tattoo Lou, Busted Bob, Basket Casey, Blended Bradley, Blake Flake, <laughs> uh, Crush Shelly, and Stormy Heather. Oh, I've still got a couple packs in here left. They look like they were stuffed in here. It's it's almost like they didn't quite fit the box, but uh, we're going to keep going. Gil Grill, Juicy Bruce, Stinky Stan, Diaper Dan, Mixed Up Mitch, Bug Betty, Crotty Kate, and Potty Scotty. Um, I'm glad I got these because these are going to be the B name for the packs that we, we pulled, what, four times already? Um, this one's kind of packed and stuffed in there and I mean that's how it came out of the box so I don't know if it's special inserted or it's just the uh the way that it was packed but let's take a look at it yep here it is um so here here we go again zero zero a um Adam Bomb this is the card supposedly um kept to 100 uh, I, I don't know if that's going to be true, but you shouldn't be pulling, if it is, you, you shouldn't be pulling two of these from a box. Uh, but we do have it, so thank you. And you guys saw that pack to begin with, right? So it's it's almost like you can tell that that was a specially inserted pack. Um, Sherman Tank, Tattoo Lou, Busted Bob, Basket Casey, Blended, Blake, Crushed, Stormy. Yeah, we've seen all those already. Um, next one. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, Gil Grill, Juicy Bruce, Stinky Stan, Diaper, Mixed Up. Yeah. Oh uh, boy. Okay. Um, I'm going to take a look at what the whole set here is, but uh, wow, that's a lot of duplicates for a pack of, gar or for a box of Garbage Field Kid cards. Um, here's something new. So um, Drew Drog, Alligator, Miles, Smiles, um, the regular Atom Bomb card, 28A for him. Um, Toe and Porcelain Lynn and Magic Wanda, Hot Scott, nice card. Um, at least they're different, <laughs> so that's nice. Uh, let's do the next pack. Hmm. Some of you are probably out there shaking your head right now. Oh, boy. So, you guys saw this, the last card. So, Drew, Allie, Miles... Here we go again. Drew, Ali, Miles, Adam. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. And let's see what this one brings us. The smile is slowly going away from my face here. Toothless, Mute Michael. So these are going to be the B names. Electric Bill, Max Axe. Uh, yeah. So that's nice. At least we got the B names for those. We still need the B names for um, the previous two packs that we pulled. And maybe that'll come here pretty soon. Nope. <laughs> Same as we pulled last pack. So nothing different. Lots of duplicates. Okay, last pack in the box. The box is empty, as you can see. Um, last pack, so let's see what we got in here. I don't believe I'm going to have a full set. Okay, uh, yep, Rad Rod, Ashcan Andy, Rusty Bolts, Snot Ball Saul, Semicolon. Yep, we've already seen these all before. Okay, so I, I know I don't have a full set because I am going to be missing some, but I will put this together and see where this ends up. I do have two additional boxes. Um, if the Atom Bomb 00A cards and Blasted Billy 00B cards are in fact limited to 100, well, I hit the jackpot. But again, I've seen a video where someone's pulled four of these. Um, I haven't heard on the forums if anyone's pulled more than one. I have seen people not get any. I have seen people pull an Atom and a Blasted Billy. I've seen a Blasted Billy and I've seen just Adam, but uh, yeah, so that's what we got. If they truly are limited to 100, well, I guess that makes up for the fact that we have multiple copies of certain cards. But uh, regardless, um, still a lot of fun. Um, hopefully you enjoyed. This was the Garbage Pail Kids Beyond the Streets wax box off of the network app. 
much like the eBay um, special that we saw mid last year. This was printed to order. So um, time will tell if it, uh, how many of these boxes went out, how many actual 00A atom bombs and 00B blasted billies there were. Okay, let's not forget about the giveaway. Um, right over here, we've got the Minikins, the Wacky Packages, and the Chrome Original Series 2 cards. Those will go out in my next video. Um, what I'd like you to do is uh, go ahead and hashtag Adam Bomb, hashtag Adam Bomb times two. So it'll be right here in your screen. It'll say hashtag Adam Bomb times two, and you'll be entered into that giveaway. Um, thanks for joining me. Uh, hopefully, you enjoyed this video. Talk to you again soon. Bye.